What's up gamers? It's me, Dova Chief here. Long time no see, guys. <laughs> Man, I have a lot of explaining to do. But don't worry, I will explain while I make this gameplay of Sea of Thieves. And yes, Sea of Thieves has finally came out. I've had this game for, I think, a week or two now. Um, I haven't been, been able to play this a lot lately because, you know, my internet hasn't been working as much. But, um... Let's just check this out, and then I'll explain more, guys. Thank you, Rare, for making a really good game. Rare treasures and riches vast from pirate legends in the past. Shared voyages with faithful crew call to sail the ocean blue. In the sea of thieves a rumors fair, a fortune lies buried there. Hidden root under fearsome sky, a fortune calls to those that try. Arr. The gold order seek beneath the sands, the keys to chess within their hands. The order of souls are full of mystery, they came to seek the skulls of history. The Merchant Alliance are seeking coin, a profit made by those that join. Basically, those are different factions. Athena's fortune now calls to ye to become legend upon the sea. Can you become legend? I don't know. Anyway, we have Galleon Sloop. I'm gonna go in a small sloop, and here's my pirate! <laughs> So basically, for me to explain myself, guys, um, as I said lately, my internet has been very slow, so I couldn't be able to play this game as much. And also, the reason why I haven't been able to make any uploads is because, well, my computer monitor here, it's a very old monitor, it's a Dell brand, and one day I was going to start recording some, uh, some stuff, you know, and just out of nowhere, like, when I turned on my computer and I was going to lo uh, like log on and whatnot, my computer just went blank, like black screen. I'm like, okay, what's going on here? So I turned off the, the screen and then restarted it. it. It started back up, it showed dim, but then later on, it, like, for a split two seconds, it went to full black again. I'm like, oh, great. So then I turned it off again and I kind of, like, w wiggled it around, like, um, and then I angled it, you know, did, did a nice little tap on the back end of it and. And it wasn't working for quite a while, and so, and then one day I decided to turn it on, and it was it was working, and then like later on the next day it stopped working. So it's like it has its ups and downs, and I'm actually glad and thankful it's working right now. And I hope even during during this gameplay I'm making, I hope this does not go black at all, because then I will not be like happy at all. Just keeping it clean like that. I will, I will not be happy at all. <laughs> like I said, I've had this game for about two weeks, if I remember correctly. Um, haven't done a whole lot on it. And I've been wanting to actually make some gameplay footage. And yes, um, I still owe you guys footage of Yoshi's Island. I have not got, uh, gone down to that yet. I have the Super Nintendo back upstairs, so... Whenever I have a chance to bring it back down, that I will continue to make gameplays. Only if you guys want me to continue some of the gameplay on there. So, all right. Hello, what's up, Terry? Terry. Bananas. Uh, I just hope that when I'm making, when I'm doing a quest here, I hope I don't lag out, because otherwise, it's not gonna be good, dude. 
So basically what I do here is loot everything around here. So, um... In order to fill up the ship. Let's see what I got here. 5.56. Five, I'll probably just go with what I have for right now, possibly. Um... So this is my rank for each faction. Gold Hoarders, I'm level 19. Gold Swabby, Order of Souls, I'm level 15. Mystic Associate, and Merchant Alliance, I'm 14. Merchant Mariner. So, my voyages, I have these three voyages, and as you see, they're for the Gold Hoarders. So it's pretty, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, I wonder if I could just jump up there. Yes! Oh, too bad I can't loot these barrels. I have a feeling I'm going to break my foot here, or my legs. Yay, I'm good. Ooh, cannonballs. Definitely need those. More cannonballs. So, since I have the gold hoarder stuff, I'm going to go ahead and do those. See if I have any messages from friends of mine at all. Nope, no messages. Okay. Because I turned off my notifications, and I want to make sure I don't miss any messages. So... Um. Load up one cannon here. Load up one cannon there. So I'm pretty much well stacked. Uh, since it's nighttime, I'm gonna turn off my lights. Oh, wrong button. So ba uh, basically, guys, if uh, if you don't know like of all the mechanics of, uh, like of the sh of the ship of how to run a ship, I can always just show you guys either way on here. It's a lot easier to um, control or steer a sloop, which is this ship, because they're smaller and it's easier to turn. It's easier to work with the anchors. But what a lot of people say, it's highly recommended that you first start out running with a uh, galleon, which is a crew of four. You can run a, a galleon, which is up to three or four people only, while a sloop can be just one to two people. So, anyway, so for a sloop here, you have your map here. You know, there's this map. Since I'm going to propose my voyage, uh, we'll just do random. We'll do this guy here. Vote. Okay. A swag snatched by the pitiful hook Handy Bert. And also, make note that even before you set sail, make sure the area is clear of any ships at all. Because you will run into some other ships that will attack you by no means. If that makes sense. Like, either way, you'll have a ship that will attack you. Okay, so I had since I received this right here, so... Study the shape of this guy, and then try to look it, find for it on the map. Uh, no, that's, that guy's not it. Uh, where is this guy at? Do, 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 do. Wait, I think I found it. Scurvy Ailey, I think. Pretty sure it is. Yep. So that's one. Beep. Now, here's my other one. Oh, I think I know what this one is. Uh, where are you, buddy? I don't think that one's it, though. Nope. That one's not it. And I cannot really hum because apparently the thing will think I'm doing something that's copyright. So, oh yeah, Lone Grove, the Lone Cove, not Lone Grove. Gosh, I can't speak right now. All right, so we have these two spots here. So, the one that's closer, well, they're about the same distance. Okay, so we'll go to this place over here first. So. Where's that treasure? Okay, it's by that rock. So, right there. So I had to go on that side. And my heading, as you see on the map here, since I'm at Dire Tooth Outpost, I have to head northwest. First, I have to circle around the area. 
So north northwest. I keep the lights on down here so I can easily see, but usually you can't you won't have to worry about other ships that will kinda of see you just because of those. But I turn off this lamp here and the two lamps in the front. And turn off this lamp here and the other one that's right here. Because when it gets dark like this, you'll be easily spotted. Okay, to run the mechanics of your boat. Okay. So it says we have to head northwest, if I remember correctly. I can still go forward like this. Raise the anchor. The anchor is pretty much your, your e-brake. And since I don't have to turn anything, I can just lower the sail with this guy here. So that's what it says. Is that sail length? And this is for the angle. You set the angle. You look up which way the wind's blowing. So it's blowing that way. You have to go that way. This is the golden handle. So you only have to see it once. We see right there. And then to even it out, uh, I'm going to wait until it gets close to the northwest. You turn this wheel to the left until you see the gold handle once. Boom, right there. Now I'm evened out. Another good thing is, I learned from front, from you know stuff. I can just look down easily right here at the map, since I am right there. I go to the outpost, so I can go over here and then and then head north. By the looks of it, I think the wind's blowing the other direction. Yeah. So set angle all the way like that. Good thing I have not experienced with the Kraken yet. So. I'm going to be a so totally against the wind right now. I'm going to go over here around this fort here. If I can head north-ish over here. Turn here. Yeah, I'm totally against the wind right now. Flight of the Valkyries, but I'm not, I'm not going to go into action, so. My favorite one. This one's called Becalmed. But you have to keep your wits about you. Look sharp for any enemy ships. Because they could be chill. Or they could be to where they'll chase you down and destroy your ship. And probably take whatever loot you have. Right now I don't have any loot, so thank God for that. And there is also word that I keep hearing a lot is about the Kraken. So the Kraken, it's really rare to actually encounter it. But the signs uh, to look for when a Kraken is about to appear is you make sure you watch the water. When the water is black, that means the Kraken is nearby and it will attack you. Now here I cannot tell for sure since it's dark out already. So I can't tell if the Kraken is going to attack at all. So. And plus what I hear that during the nighttime or daytime you hear like like a wailing type of noise during like during like whenever I heard from other people that that's the sound of the Kraken apparently now no one knows what the Kraken really looks like because I even saw like other videos about it that even when you, even when you jump inside the water you won't see it it's like it's like black they don't have an actual model for it the only thing you'll see is just the tentacles of the Kraken so since I did my research um, in order to beat the Kraken, you, t you attack the tentacles that are more closer to your ship. Because if you attack the ones that are further out, obviously, that the ones closer to your ship will pretty much latch onto your ship and destroy it. Along with you w with it, so. So. I'm going to go ahead and turn left. I'm pretty sure it's over there. 
so yeah, there's just a lot of info to take in but if you guys have any questions about this game I can do my best to kind of answer the best of, of my knowledge now I did see an angry Joe review on this game where he says they, they done messed it up that um, that yeah it it is a sandbox game but that, like it's lacking content and it's like obviously like I have I mean no disrespect towards Angry Joe I I've I subscribe to him and I always look at his channel for any uh, reviews for any other games that I I have seen but um and he's also mentioned in the video to where he's had people kind of harass him a little bit you know saying well Joe, you know, it's j just a sandbox, and plus, it j the game just launched out. There's bound to be more content. I mean, yes, there is. You know, like, I'd say to not make an argument at all whatsoever, everyone has their opinions, you know. I mean, sure, yes, Joe is partially right that this game is not fully finished yet. You know, he's right about that. You know, I'm not going to argue with that, you know. But, uh... You know, it's just not finished yet. Just like, for example, when he killed a shark and whatnot, you know, that expecting to get something from it, and then but instead you got nothing, you know? So, I agree with him on that, that you should get something. Something from killing something, you know? And so, basically, since I'm here, I'm going to raise my sails to, lo to slower my speed. If I can do it all the way up, if I can. I just hope I don't hit another land. And then, drop my e-brake. Since I'm right here, I cannot tell what side am I on right now. So I need to go down here and see and zoom in. Oh, sweet, sweet. Okay, so it's to my directly left. So I think it's where that is right there. So I'm going to go ahead and jump in. But yeah, I agree with Angry Joe for the most part in regards to this game. So... There's, like, no arguments there at all. Alright. Now, I'm going to do more research on this game as well, because I guess I hear sometime in the future for an update of the game, which I think has already been updated, that um, possibly that there's going to be, like, a death toll or something. Because I guess for some people like when they die, they still have their stuff with free supplies and whatnot. Which, um, I, I guess that would kind of bug me a little bit if they patch that. I mean, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm, perhaps I'm wrong, but... Okay, so even if they patch it up, you know, I just hope they won't patch it to where, to where we still get free bullets from here, though. You know? Because I, even I go through a lot of bullets. So it's pretty crazy. I'm gonna look around here on this place here. Ooh, that's a golden chicken. It's a golden chicken. I, if only there, if only there was a chicken coop here. I think there is. Beep 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 beep. Oh, dude, that would be great if I had a chicken coop. I mean, perhaps I perhaps I could be wrong about the golden chicken, but I would say you get a lot from the golden chicken, you know, because it's gold. <laughs> nope. Whoa! I fell in. I fell in. I fell in. Okay, there's not... No, there's nothing here as I see. Just these barrels over here. I pretty much circled around this whole island. I don't see anything shiny I could pick up, which is a message in a bottle, so should be fine. I'm just gonna have to move on. Move on, move on, move on. Plus, also, the more you, you level up, you'll get more gold and stuff whenever you sell the chests or, or any other stuff for different factions. So, um, 
And you can use the gold to get more stuff for your pirate, or you can customize your ship, which I'm actually going to customize my, my ship. But man, you have to do a massive amount of grinding. I mean, I tell you. Because for even one specific thing for customizing a ship is like 70,000 gold. And right now, I have 37,861. So, that's a grind. That's a literal grind. Okay, so... I had to head southwest. Well, I could just lower the sails here. And then right when I get on this rock, I'm to steer around that. I kind of feel like humming, but I don't want to like hum something that that, that could be copyright. Because that's what happened. I was playing Yoshi's Island. Like, I was humming something random. I didn't even know what it was or anything like that. And I had no idea I was going to get copyrighted just for humming, uh, like, a certain tune. Which I never knew it was a certain tune, you know? <laughs> so, it's... Yeah, it's kind of hard. Okay, so I need to turn a little bit to the right by the looks of it. So... To the right, to the right, to the right, right, right. To the right. Uh, little like... And I kind of sang a little tune there, and I should not be doing that. Better angle my sails here. Like honestly, uh, when I when I started playing this game when it finally came out, I basically listened to the Pirates of the Caribbean theme. While just doing all these quests and whatnot, so I just got so inspired. I'm pretty sure that's the island. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly go down here so I can kind of zoom in a little bit. Ah, uh, it's on the southwest side, so I'll have to circle around. over there. So I have to still go around this island, so it'll be on the southwest side. Better angle my sails here. Ooh, barrels. Barrels! Like how PewDiePie would say that. <laughs> I'm actually glad I'm able to make videos again, guys, because you don't know how much I'm, I miss making videos for you guys. Make some content. It's great. Sadly, I'm going to turn against the wind. Even out, even out, even out, even out. Ooh, okay. But yeah, basically, guys, uh, when you when you um, set the length of your sails, it pretty much sets the speed of your ship. Especially when you angle them in, uh, like into the wind, it will make it go faster. Like so. When you do it halfway, you do half the speed. So I'm gonna do it like about that much, and then I can easily turn. Another thing is you have to keep a close eye where you don't get too close to the island. Because sometimes it's hard to tell. Okay. So that's where that guy is. Okay, we're going to circle around here more. It looks like it's clear so far of any skeletons. So far, I haven't seen a skeleton yet. Trust me, of how I got this good so far of of, sa of sailing a ship is because I had a couple experiences with a with a galleon. 
so let me turn to the right there a little bit watch me hit land oh I didn't hit land yay okay so since I'm here I'm gonna go ahead and go in the crow's nest real fast I didn't want that I didn't want to ring the bell uh -uh. no 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 All right, let's see what we got here. Just that is just funny. I don't see any skeletons, but I see a couple pigs and see because there's a pig right over there. There's a pig right there, and another pig, another pig. Man, this must be pig land. <laughs> The little piglets. There's one right there. So, if I'm not mistaken, I'd say the treasure is actually right. I'd say it's right about there where that cobra is. Another tip, guys, which obviously you guys sh should know, because it took me a while to actually notice. Apparently, I was a dumbo. That you can charm a cobra with your instruments. Okay. Where's that cobra? Okay, there, there's the cobra. You, you, know, you just stay with the cobra. I don't want any trouble. Stay over there. Don't want any trouble. Okay, it's right here. It should be right here. Oh, uh, no. Where's it right here? Right here. Yep, right here. Uh, um, guys, I could be mistaken, but that kind of looks like it's gold right there. Oh, these guys, I love these treasure chests just because the looks of them, and I think you can get more gold out of these things, too. Marauder's chest. I love these things. Just by the looks of them. Oh, God! There is another pirate. There is another pirate. Oh, God. Oh, God. I need to set sail. Oh my gosh, guys, my heart's pumping right now. It's pumping really, really fast. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I gotta set sail. Oh. Guys, you don't, you don't know how much I'm freaking out right now. Oh. What? I, I should have spot them ahead of time. Because I think they're gonna be after my treasure. No. Oh my gosh. Okay, which way am I going? Which way am I going? Which way am I going? Uh, da, 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 da. Guys, guys, you have no idea how much I'm freaking out right now. Oh, God. Okay, I need to set sail to Sanctuary Outpost. So I need to head southwest. Oh, oh he's he's really trying to aim for me right now. He's I think he's really trying to aim for me right now. Oh, God, guys. Oh, my gosh. I think he's really trying to... Oh my gosh. See if I can outsail them. Oh my gosh. Their sails are not all the way down, so. Come on, set these angles. There we go. Oh, guys, I think that was a close one. I hope I got away with... Uh, I hope I got away from them. 
because some of these guys can be very, very, very smart. Well, they'll literally shoot themselves out of a cannon. I think that's what they did to try to try to get to me. Oh my gosh, what an experience, guys! Because my heart is racing right now. Okay, the chest below deck is not really my concern. I want to make sure I sell this chest right here. I might get some decent gold out of it. Okay. So... quickly sell, sell this chest right here right before they have a chance to kill me I don't care if they take the other chest you know I don't care about that I got this one which is my main concern because I think I can get more, a lot more gold out of this if I can just sell, sell both these in time I should be fine Four hundred twenty-one. Four hundred twenty-one. Okay. Cool. 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 Looks like I'll have enough time to sell both these chests. Cool. 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 I don't care if they sink my ship. So. But I'm just worried about, like, if they were to sink my ship, I think I'll lose all my supplies that are in it, which is going to really suck. Okay, I just need to quickly look around for any supplies, so. Yeah, yep, yeah, I knew it. I would get a lot more from that first chest. I don't know where those guys are at right now. I hope they had no interest in me. Four. Oh, clearly they're over there. Cool, cool. They can mind their own business. I'll, man, I'll mind my own, and we should be good. Oh, well, at least my heart rate's starting to slow down now, because, dude, you have no idea how fast my heart was pumping. Not good. I could have easily had a heart attack. That would not be good. Okay, um... I'm going to hold off doing some other quests for right now. Because I don't want another experience like that just happen, so. I should have enough time to bring the ship a little closer to the dock, though. Yeah, that rocket starts to set sail at night. Yeah, those, I don't think those guys are much doing anything, so. Alright, so 25, 24, 25. 626. Yeah, I'm I'm Mr. Perfect over here, so. Yay, it's perfect. So
Well, I don't want to actually do this any longer. Um, I'll just get ready to stop it at here, guys. So, um, that's all the time for today, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Dova Chief out.